I supposed to do? I've been playing this game so much, but I can't get any better. What am I supposed to do? I heard you needed my help. Uh, uh, how did you get into my house? Do you want to play Smash Bros at a professional level without trying to put all the effort into training every day? Well, I have the solution to you. Introducing Hero! Hero is an amazing character and a good example of why you should never let interns have the power to put characters in the game. But what's so special about Hero, you may be asking? Well, most characters in Super Smash Bros. are like playing a sport, practicing every day, trying to get down precise movements and strategies. Hero's like rolling a dice and saying yay if you get a number above two. Let me take you into the basics on what makes Hero a hero. <laughs> Let's get in to step number one, critical hits. Is the player you're versing using actual combos and racking up tons of damage using strings that he's practiced, while you just want to flick the funny yellow stick around and hope you get a kill? Well, Hero is great for you. Not only does Hero have one of the most powerful smash attacks in the game, it has a 1 in 8 chance to just crit. And what does that mean? Well, forget everything you knew about what percent is supposed to kill, because Critical hits just kill it any! And best of all, how can you be punished? Not only does Hero have barely any end lag to start out with, it's not like you take any punishment for missing, so just, you know what? Just pretend you're playing Galaga and just sing, swish, sing, swish, swish sing. that C stick back and forth until you eventually get the kill. Let's talk about another great part about Hero the down B menu. Hero is obviously the best because he has the most moves in the game. It makes just perfect sense, right? Now, 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 it might seem a bit daunting, you know? 21 spells in one move? How can you keep track of all those? That's the thing. You don't. See, our specialized experts on the game have found out that by not reading and just selecting any option you want, actually results in success 100% of the time. Why does this happen? Well, you're not really gonna get a bad spell. All of them are good, so might as well just press buttons, you know? And it might work out for you. Let's get some insight on hero spells so you can finally figure out how you killed the opponent randomly at 40% without even realizing it. All of hero's projectile moves pack a serious punch. Whether they're the explosive, huge blast moves like Kaboom, or super fast pew 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 like Sizz, Hero also has lots of sword moves, and not those boring ones you can do all the time without even opening the menu. <laughs> Who wants those? Safe options. Lame. Alright, we want moves that pack punch. For example, Hatchet Man. Say goodbye to your shield, bro, because you're gonna miss it a lot. While we're on the topic of swords, what about Flame Slash? I mean, it's so fast, you might as well not even react to it. Not only will the opponent not be able to re react to it, but you can't react to it. And if you don't know what you're thinking, your opponent can't know what you're thinking. It's common sense. Finally, we get to a fan favorite, Magic Burst. Is edge guarding too hard? Do you struggle going off stage because you forgot what button is to jump? Well, fear no more, because as long as you have like over two mana, all you have to do is press magic burst on the ledge, and it does all the hard work for you. Finally, we get to the third and final step to being a master hero player, managing your magic points. Magic points are all of the magic that Hero needs to use for his spells and other special moves. Now, it can probably seem pretty complicated to try and manage all these things at once, but like I said before, 
Just throw out random spells. It doesn't matter how much they cost, as long as the enemy is dying. That's what matters at the end of the day. And when you eventually run out of magic points, what do you do? Use your sword to get some back on hit? <sighs> what? What is this, EVO Grand Final? That's so lame! Instead, what you should do is use Kamikaze, because not only does he make a huge explosion that damages that enemy, you also get all your magic points back. It's amazing! Hero is a fantastic character, fun for the whole family, especially your little brother who's never won a match before. Hero is now available for the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Fighters Pass. You can buy the entire Fighters Pass for $24.99, but why do that when Hero's all that matters? Just buy him separately for $7.99. My name's Johnny Rich, and that is a guide to Hero.